do you mean people? What people are gonna get really fussy over the way how we make omelets? Just say I'm doing my 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 breakfast sausage and eggs. And I'm doing my breakfast with sausage and eggs. If you if you're having a slight me for my omelets, I'm not gonna lie. I'm pretty sure you should probably get off the internet. How big do you want the sausage? No, don't stop. That was good. Could have gone worse. It's just a pancake. Ooh, good morning, Vietnam. Hello, everyone. Welcome back. Welcome back. Back, 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 back. back. It's another wonderful day here at the house but it is monday and it is a good day today i've got a lot planned i have just big projects planned i have one video for someone else and then i have one of my own videos and i'm gonna do that now and then i have writing to get done so i just have big projects but it's not many of them shout out baby. so previously i've done craig and i've done lydia uh, today's another friend and someone i know this is grace lee so recently i learned some work for grace i did a promo for her that went on her instagram and she did it behind the scenes on youtube it went really well she's really really good to work with and she's unbelievable talented at what she does. Make sure you go follow Grace. I'll put a link down below and you can go and subscribe. <laughs> right, I should probably stop talking to the camera and get on with some very important editing I need to get done. I actually created my own theory of uh, character arcs and it's going to be called The Roach's Egg, mainly because I drew it and it looks like an egg. So I just got done editing the first, no, the, the, thir the third Monday vlog. I just like, on the fourth Monday vlog now, I just like to say I'm just, I'm so just wowed by like how this is going crazy 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 and it's the enthusiasm i'm getting from you guys but i'm gonna try out an effect today i want to try and make my guns no my guns my what no what i want to make my fingers into guns i'm gonna do finger guns i'm gonna make blow blow up not blow up i'm gonna make them shoot uh, it's an effect I've, I've seen loads of people do i, I mean i've kind of like grew up watching like corridor crew uh andreas hands i've seen people do this a like, thousand times i'll put a link down below of some of my favorite channels to do stuff like this like times like this give me a good opportunity to experiment with different ones so if i ever need to in the future what i would have to with my newest film it's gonna come in handy because i'd already have that experience if you know what i mean right so that's just done i'm gonna upload that video then I, i've got a bit of another video i think i'm gonna do a bit more stop motion then it's finger guns time there we go oh my god I literally i've been so busy today everything just keeps coming up anyway so i'm gonna try out the finger guns now um oh god right um So, a lot of time has passed and I've done quite a bit of work and other stuff and I've been researching how to do it and there's this really sick plugin called Bang. I'm everywhere suggesting it, but the problem is, it's $75, so I'm gonna have to do it legit. I'm gonna experiment with it, you know, give me, give me a chance. Sorry. Just before I continue on, I've just had dinner, right, okay. A moth just nosedived behind my computer, missing it. Yeah, a huge bloody moth. It's just nosedived and just hit the wall. I'm in Premiere Pro now. I have my clip there in the timeline, as you can see. And I downloaded this uh, action hit set. I have no idea where I got it from. Never used it before, but I have some muzzle flashes here. Let's get to the part where I'm doing the guns and stuff. Like, oh, like a cool kid. Right, okay. Right, let's just work on this one here. Wow, that's big, okay. And, right, I'm gonna make this 3D. Just because I'm shooting on an angle, which is really weird. Okay, awesome, awesome source. Right, now it's kind of time for where the gunshot's gonna go. And also I might try some stuff with highlights in the face. I know it's quite hard in Premiere Pro, but I reckon we can we can we can do some stuff to make it look a bit more a bit more realistic. Hello, right, okay, so it's finished. Um here's the final clip. There, as you can see, I've added quite a, I've added quite a few layers. The bullet hit on the wall, personally, I'd like to color grade it a bit more. I might put over a whole like, lot over this, possibly, to make it all kind of leveled, if that makes sense. I have added smoke coming in from the side, almost like the smoke's gonna come round and in front of the screen, in front of me. I've added a masking effect, so muzzle flash, rather than just appearing, kind of spawns from my fingers, if that makes sense. Um, I've added smoke coming out of my hand, as if like, a bullet just come out, but um, I track, I track 
to my hand with the muzzle flash and the smoke. I'm happy with it. I feel like if I was doing a big film, I might invest into that bang software. Doing muzzle flashes and guns is quite a lengthy process to get a good result if I'm ever doing a big project like that. Plus, I can have a lot of fun with it. I'm sorry if I just chatted stuff that makes no sense to you. You know, every vlog is different, and tomorrow is a special one. I'm not gonna tell you what's in tomorrow vlogs. You're gonna have to wait and see. But for, oh yeah, I'm um, also, I didn't get a chance to do more of my stop motion today. I'm gonna work on it tomorrow because I have a bit more time and I had other projects. You, you know what I mean. Without further ado, thank you for watching the video. As always, if you wanna see my other content, it's in my channel. Make sure to subscribe. I'll see you tomorrow, dudes. See you then. Bye guys, bye. Go, leave me, please. I need a drink, please.